Hello everyone, this is Joshua Paduku, committed at Apache Dev Lake, and I'm here to help you get started. Apache Dev Lake is a project, uh, it's an open source project which helps you to get the engineering metrics and create some dashboards for your teams. And this will help you to analyze and make some important decisions and next steps for your team. So as you can see, we are right here in the Apache Dev Lake local uh, host setup and you can always get the latest one as possible. So the latest update includes the onboarding process as I show it here. The aim of the onboarding process is to help you um, shortening the time of getting the first uh, metric and you can pull the latest one and if you haven't gone through this quick start guide right in our documentation there are different ways you can install dev lake and let's get it started the project here is a service or a microservice that's deployed in dev lake and it pulls data from different tools like GitHub, Jenkins, PagerDuty, CircleCI, Bitbucket, Jira, and so on. And it helps you to group the data and organize the data using DevLake. I've named the project as Engineering Overview and the data connection is selected as GitHub. So let's go to the next step and configure the connection. Uh, so you need personal access token to configure the connection. And to get that, it's very simple. You can go to GitHub. If you click on this icon and go to settings, you'll find developer settings at the left-hand side at the bottom. And as you go there, you will be seeing personal access token and make sure you are taking the classic token. And I've already copied the token here. So let me pull the token very quickly. As we enter the token and connect, so this has successfully configured the connection. As we move on to the next step, we can see what we can do with Dev Lake. So adding a data scope enables you to pull the data uh, from issues, deployments, um, GitHub Actions, uh, pull requests, etc. So you can see what you can do right in our documentation. And to ensure that the onboarding is faster for you, we are only collecting 14 days of data. So you can always customize the data later on. So I've selected Dev Lake and you can go for next step. And as you can see here, we are actually pulling data um, from the GitHub in real time. So as we wait, we will go on uh, to see what it's actually doing. Um, it's cloning the repository, collecting the commits, collecting different branches, collecting different tags where you can segregate the metrics and you know you can see on Grafana dashboard right after this process. So let's wait. And here we are with the dashboard. So let's check the dashboard and the default password for Grafana dashboard is admin and admin. And here is the magic happens when you see all the engineering metrics um, through GitHub. And this is the data from um, Dev Lake's repository, which is quite huge. And we have tons of data. So you can always customize the data and you know, you can see other dashboards which are related to your CI/CD pipelines, your data sources, etc. So and once you finish the onboarding process, you will be redirected to this project section and you can see our project is here. And you can always change the settings. You can add more data connection. As we said, we collect only 14 days of data and you can always change the data you want to collect and, and this is it. And you are successfully onboarded to Dev Lake. And I'm excited to have you on board. And feel free to open a feature request or if you face any issue, open an issue on GitHub. Since we are an open source project uh, driven by the community, we have lots of engineering leaders, uh, community contributors, and members who believe in our software. Um, 
so you can join our slack don't miss that so we have lots of webinars and events coming up and lots of educational activities within our slack so make sure you join the slack and also start us on github thank you so much